Hey guys, welcome back to Tony's How To's. In this video, I'll be showing you how to find phone by IMEI number. Before we start, hurry up and check out the software just under this video. So let's get started. In this case, you might be wondering, how do you find your phone by its IMEI number? Well, in this case, we first need to discuss what is an IMEI number, which in this case, the IMEI number is a unique identifier for mobile devices, which in this case, you can find this via the about section in your phone or even at the uh, sticker at the back of your phone whenever you open it up. Now, in this case, in some cases, whenever you lost your phone and you have the IMEI number with you, well, in this case, uh, there are ways for you to actually locate using the IMEI number. But I do have to warn you a few things here before you actually proceed. Now, in this case, we first need to discuss, can you actually do it yourself? So, obviously, I'm uh, actually expecting that you already did your research here because, again, IMEI number is not that common. So, again, if you have your details yourself, uh, you might, you're thinking maybe you can track your own phone. Well, in this case, uh, whenever you're searching online, you might see different websites offering that they could actually track your phone through the IMEI number that you have right now. So in this case, we now need to discuss, is it actually possible? Well, the thing here is there are tools out there that could actually track your phone through its IMEI number. But the thing here is... Uh, those tools are only available for government agencies or in this case, uh, police or um, regarding or for military purposes. So basically, it is not available for the uh, for public use. So not anyone can use the tools or technologies to track an IME, uh, IME number here of your phone which in this case, you won't be able or most likely you won't be able to use those tools. Now, if you see websites offering that, that they can actually do or basically search your phone or locate your phone through its IMEI number, well, you need to be worried. Sometimes these websites are going to be uh, scams or they are actually uh, legitimate websites. So meaning they just aim to basically uh, cash you out, steal your money if you try availing their services. Now, again, I just really need to emphasize this one. Most likely, tools for locating IMA numbers are not available for the public. So not all companies or most companies does not have these tools or does not have the capabilities of actually locating IMA number. So uh, we all know that the government or any other entities out there respect the uh, actual um location or the privacy of people so they don't uh, just use it uh, randomly out there so in this case the next best thing that you could do here is uh, the following options that we'll be showing you so one of them is to the use of your google account so if you're not aware yet we have a thing called uh, uh, google maps which google maps actually allows you to track your history so in this case, I'm in google.com. So go ahead and log in into your account. So at the top right, if you have it. So in this case on our Google account, you need to click on the Google apps icon here, go to maps. And under maps, what we need to do is we need to go to the top left here. And under uh, on the uh, top left, what we need to do is we need to choose the option for uh, the timeline or your timeline section which in this case, it should open up a new tab, which in this case, it's going to show you all the timeline or the location where you went. That includes your recent locations. So if you have your Google account actually lock in into your mobile phone, then most likely you should be able to track where your phone actually went through. Now, obviously I don't have much data on my account here, but once you click on the your timeline option here, you should be able to see different dots on the map where your phone actually went or where you actually went. Now, this is an alternative that you could use here, although they don't actually showcase the actual location itself, unless that phone actually shares the location. But yeah, so in this case, this is the best next thing that we could do here, that we could actually do it ourselves. Now, if you're unable to do this, like you don't, you don't you're not using your Google account here, you, you haven't shared your uh, location with anyone, well, the next best thing here is to reach out to authorities, which in this case, if you reach out or report that your phone is stolen, most likely they will be able to actually give you or assist you um, the services on actually locating your phone through the use of IMA number. Now, in this case, make sure to have your IME number with you. And in this case, also mention to them that you have your IME number if they need it, just in case they will be using any tools to locate your phone using those number. But yeah, so in this case, that's about it. 
So remember, uh, those tools that is available on uh, for finding IMI numbers right now are not uh, are not available for the public. So make sure to be wary and be vigilant with scam websites or legitimate legitimate websites out there, so that you won't be losing your money or even not or for them to actually prevent uh, losing your information and being hacked. But in this case, that's about it. So if you found this video helpful, hit the like and subscribe button and watch our next video.